25 reasons why Jesus is false. Reason number 11, Jesus was not divine nor without sin. Many people want to believe or have been convinced to believe that Jesus was not a sinner and that he led a sinless life because they want him to be a sacrifice for their sins. They want to believe he achieved perfection and now you could hop on his back and also be saved because he did it and he's going to take you with him. But this is not so. The scriptures do not lie. Scripture upon scripture, anyone born of a, of a woman, basically a human, a man, is not without sin. Psalms 130, verse 3. If thou, Yah, shouldest mark iniquities, O Yahweh, who shall stand? But there is forgiveness with thee, that thou mayest be feared. The reason humans are not perfect and without sin is the Most High Yah has to stand out. He gives us forgiveness for our sins. He is shown to be perfect. We, we are the ones with the flaws, so we can't be perfect. But he gives us forgiveness for our sins. We don't need Jesus to die for us. We have to um, stand below the Most High because we are but humans. He is perfect. He's from everlasting. Proverbs 20, verse 9. Who can say, I have made my heart clean? I am pure from my sin. Who can say that? Well, I have to admit, Jesus never said that. Jesus never said he was without sin. Let's read Matthew 19, verse 17. And he saith to him, Why are you asking me what is good? There is only one who is good. But if you wish to enter into life, keep the commandments. So Jesus himself testified that the only Yah, the Most High, was good. He couldn't say that he was um, a sinless man because he knows that's not true. Second Samuel 2 verse 2. There is none set apart as Yahweh. For there is none besides thee, neither is there any rock like our Elohim. So if you're saying that Jesus is set apart as Yahweh, you're saying 2 Samuel 2 and 2 is lying. Some of you believe that Jesus is sitting right next to the Most High Yah because you misinterpret scriptures. You don't understand the scriptures. But there is no rock like our Elohim. fact, Jesus was not without sin, as he was a man born of a woman, and he couldn't possibly be. Fear the Most High, Yah. Ecclesiastes 7, verse 20. For there is not a just man upon the earth that doeth good, and sinneth not. Job 15, verse 14. What is man? That he should be clean. And he which is born of a woman, that he should be righteous. Behold, he put it no trust in his saints. Yea, the heavens are not clean in his sight. So even the heaven isn't clean enough for the Most High. Psalms 14, verse 3. None that doeth good, no, not one. Is Psalms 14 and 3 lying? Is there one person that doeth good? Is his name Jesus? No, not, 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 nope, not so. Not one that doeth good. The scriptures don't lie. Psalms 143 verse 2. In thy sight shall no man live and be justified. So not even Jesus can be justified in the sight of the Most High Yah. No man living. Was Jesus not alive? Was he not made of flesh? Was he not born of a woman? Was he not of the seed of man? Some of you believe in immaculate conception and i will cover that in another reason but many of you christian israelites believe that jesus was born of the seed of a man so he was just like you and you and i he was just a regular man isaiah 64 verse 6 but we are all 
as an unclean thing, and all our righteousness are as filthy rags. And we do fade as a leaf, and our iniquities, like the wind, have taken us away. So Jesus' righteousness can be compared to a filthy rag. So the one you want to cover your sins is as a filthy rag. There's no way Jesus was a sinless man. And I'm going to prove it with more reasons. But this is reason number 11. Why Jesus is false. He was but a man and can't possibly be without sin. Only the Most High is perfect and without sin. He's blameless. The Most High Yahweh is blameless. Not a single man on earth. We are all sinners. Hallelujah. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on notifications for new videos. If you were blessed and enjoyed this topic and like my style of teaching the word of Yah, support me on Patreon. I can't continue making videos and posts without the support of my Patreon. Patreons also get special perks and more information. See the link on the information tab. Shalom and Yah bless.